If you are using Revision Effects plugins within Final Cut Pro 10, you can save any combination of video effects and video effect parameter settings as a video effects preset which appears in the effects browser and functions like any other video effect. You can create an effects preset from any combination of built-in effects and clip effects. After you create an effects preset, you can share it with friends and colleagues so that the same preset with its specific combination of effects and parameter settings is available in their effects browser. If you plan to use the GPU, you would just need to go to the Use GPU menu and select Use GPU. To save a video effects preset, first you select the clip in the timeline. You can choose File, Save Video Effects Preset. The Save Video Effects Preset window appears with any applied or adjusted effects selected in the attributes list. Now you can enter the name for the new preset in the name field. Next, you will click the category pop-up menu and choose an effects browser category where you will store the new preset. Now in the attributes list, you can select the video effects you want to include in your preset. If you made any keyframe adjustments to the source clip, you will select either maintain timing or stretch to fit. If you select stretch to fit, Final Cut Pro adjusts the keyframes in time to match the duration of any clip to which you apply your preset. Now you will save. The new video effects preset appears in the effects browser category you choose, ready to be applied to clips in the timeline. To apply the preset to a clip, you can do the following. You will select the effects button above the timeline and in the effects browser type the name for the video effect you previously saved and drag the effect to the timeline clip you want to apply it to or double click the effect thumbnail to apply it to the selected clip. You can now adjust the effect. This is how you save and apply preset video effects in Final Cut Pro 10. <laughs>